Hi Libra, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. But let's start with how do you um, present yourself to the opposite or same sex? Sex, sex. <laughs> we have Queen of Wands, Empress. Unbelievable energy. The best we've received so far. But people really really like you at the first impression you someone who's highly desirable um empress is ruled by or rules taurus venus but someone who's uh, quite self-assured um radiates a lot of warmth confidence but physically extremely appealing um i don't know what else to say that, it, that this combination is the best um, to receive for anyone I think there's no lack of options here there's no way because how you're being perceived as it's it's really in your hands um, who you want you're in control here um, positive traits you have as a lover we have nine of cups chariot also this is feminine energy I don't want to miss that it's very Someone who dresses well, very passionate, goes for his or her goals, um, well-dressed, smells nice. Someone who knows their self-worth is this pairing here. But your positive traits, we have Nine of Cups, Chariot. So you're, <laughs> you're emotionally very fulfilled. You don't need anyone. And that's what makes you very attractive um people see you as having it all and you almost come across as like you don't need anyone um this talks about control but someone I, the energy i'm getting from you is a very adventurous you may love to travel a lot um you don't like to sit in one place for too long with that chariot um but also that talks about determination um and someone who has a good uh, grasp over their emotions so just a dignified something persona is what i'm getting is how others perceive you someone of high value sometimes um your options may be intimidated by you because your energy is uh, quite powerful here it's almost a uh, unattainable energy is what i'm getting this top row um what makes you hard to love so we have king of swords five of swords you can be argumentative perhaps as a lover at times you're someone who's too detached and logical that is possible but someone with a sharp tongue also really uh, pay attention to your words um, they can really um have a impact on another so your words are very powerful so there's a need to really choose your words carefully is what i'm getting with that combination how you can overcome this we have hermit emperor really think things through um if you're feeling angry maybe withdraw and think over what you're about to say um it's something in regards to how you communicate because swords are our mind um how we process things um this can also talk about jealousy competitiveness that sort of thing and emperor is talking about having more control um so again i'm getting a need to have more of a filter perhaps you really need to think through what you're about to say um And really observe your reactions. Why are you reacting so strongly? What is being triggered within you? Uh, this talks about soul searching. Is there um, something in regards to your childhood, your father, abandonment issues? That there needs to be some deeper, um, thorough investigation in regards to your reactions. There. What kind of men or women you're attracting? We have ten of pentacles. Seven of Wands, Nine of Pentacles, you attract, mm, 
you could attract very stingy people to you that don't like to find that they're very clingy to their possessions. What's the op? I think stingy is the word, but it could be financially, but very cold, distant people is what you attract towards you or those that don't let you completely in um, into their mind, their heart, that sort of thing. Or people that are in a relationship with you but still act independent with the nine of pentacles they act single what you need to attract we have high priestess sun six of cups you need someone who's honest um, who doesn't hide things from you and someone who is emotional because this is pisces and six of cups is scorpio with leo we have someone who's emotionally expressive someone it's almost as if you need someone who really satisfies your inner child as well you need something fun light-hearted flirty but also with a lot of depth to it is what i'm getting and someone who's who won't hide things from you when you may meet this person you love interest we have seven of cups eight of cups so seven or eight months but also talks about you having a lot of options and now it's just it's in your control um you have options you just need to choose which one you want really listen to your intuition in regards to that but seven eight months um let's get more about the person you are attracting um, I want to get a Chinese uh, zodiac symbol for this person, which will sum up their personality, and then we can get more into um, first impressions, uh, physical characteristics. Uh, will the attraction be instant? That sort of thing. Libra singles. What is this? Tiger? Yeah, you're the first uh, sign to get tiger. So we have Yang, Wood, Brave, Forthright, and Honorable, keeps promises and expects others to likewise, to do likewise, confident and spontaneous to the point of recklessness. Tiger can seem arrogant to less dynamic folk. Life with a tiger is never dull, but it can be risky. Tiger's rest, recklessness can lead to failure, but a tiger never stays down for too long. Mm, bit of a daredevil risk, risk taker. But someone who's honest. That's beautiful. But let's get more from your tarot cards. Who is Libra Singles New Love Personality Trait? very busy person very work focused quite hard working why yeah th they're also getting um, through a breakup here. They could be moving. Yeah, a lot of changes, destined changes for this person. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Mm. Okay. They're switching direction in some aspect of their life. It could be uh, in regards to love, but we also have a lot of work on um, pentacles. So perhaps they're leaving one job for another. But whatever risk they are taking um, with that Wheel of Fortune, Six of Wands, 
this is like hitting the lottery or some sort of lucky fortunate event um so highly successful but as a person who they are quite optimistic hard working um they do have a lot going on so busy can travel a lot back and forth but king of swords is highly intelligent someone who really is fit if we look at his exterior he usually comes across as very cold detached aloof that sort of energy quite distant um this isn't someone who uh, wears their heart on their sleeve they really like to make decisions based on logic um so that is their overall uh, vibe a highly confident individual also gets a lot of attention but in general this talks about victory and someone who's successful quite career focused though mm -hmm. i want to see let's do will the attraction be instant will the attraction be instant between libra singles and their new person yes yes <laughs> um love at first sight for one of you is what i'm getting could be you but uh, yes you will see the opportunity right away king of cups is it's for first i think there will be emotions here from the get-go but eight of wands is very fast uh, movement and this talks about communication so I think um, intellectually you'll really get each other. Let's see what else we can ask. Um, their intention, or what does this person want or expect from a lover? Someone who is flexible with them, but also it was how you were showing up exactly your energy in the first spread is what they're looking for. So someone who's well, well off on their own. Um, this is usually a very independent uh, card um, where this, this guy has his nine cups. He's just He just needs one more and he has the ten of cups. So you're fine on your own and this is what this person wants someone who is stable and is willing to put in the effort um for something long term a knight of pentacles is slow mo slow moving but it it doesn't like to waste its energy so it's cautious but this person always has a a long-term vision and if they they don't see value or long-term potential in something they won't waste their energy um and that's what they're looking for something grounded long-term what will libra's first impression of this person be first impression You're meeting through school, some practical matter here, where this person is working very hard. They could be a student. But, or if at work, a new person showing up at your work, but you, your first impression is this person's um, extremely dedicated and very detail-oriented is your first impression. What will their first impression of Libra be? <laughs> do you see how the page and the knight the page and the knight how i laid up the cards are focused on the queen they'll see you as they may be a bit intimidated by you oh my god yeah this person sees the marriage or emotional satisfaction I was telling you about that nine of cups that they're look they just need one more cup and they're the ten so you're their tenth cup and you're exactly what they're looking for someone who's very nurturing giving stable and someone who's a, 
financially secure and that can provide them with a stable home life and they they're willing to put in the effort as well beautiful I, I want more about you Libra how will you feel when you meet I think um, it's this person that will pursue you. You're, you'll feel a bit distant. It's almost as if this energy is unexpected to you because Knight of Swords, you don't really see him charging in. He's very aggressive. And Two of Swords is someone who's not seeing what's right in front of them. But it's also someone who's, who needs more information. It's, I, I can't make a decision because I need more clarity. So I think, I don't think you will, ha you, you feel blah. It's almost like I want to get to know you better. I don't know you. Um, but this can start off as a friendship, I think. Strong communication between you both, this Aquarius energy. But you will be in control with that Queen of Wands. For how they're feeling, they, it's almost as if they're a bit bored and stuck or they're walking away from something. We saw that in their previous energy. So the sun, they're, it, when they meet you, they feel like they're walking from this gloomy night evening. They're walking straight into the sun. So you'll really brighten up their day when they meet you. This is what I'm getting there. Let's see if we can get uh, physical characteristics and their profession okay physical characteristics of this new person libra single this person has really nice eyes and i think that's what will attract you but page of pentacles is someone who's highly attractive um especially their face beautiful if you look at this card that they really this is perfect feature someone who takes care of themselves um perhaps goes to the gym but a youthful demeanor And we have peacock there as well so yes very very beautiful they will catch your eye it yeah another thing about their physical characteristic you'll see them as quite mysterious or secretive and they're holding back a lot. A bit of a stoic expression I'm getting from them. Yeah, yeah, you won't get much. This is, I'm getting a strong message. A bit of a stone wall. They're feeling a lot. We saw that with the sun and for how they'll feel when they see you. But they're not showing you that. But this is a very agile person who moves quick, fast on their feet. Um, let's see if I can get anything else. But also well balanced here. This person is clean shaven and with the darker hair. We have light and dark hair. Um, 
what I'm getting, you're more established in life than this person because you're, they're a page of pentacles. They are viewing you as the queen of pentacles. So in some aspect, they feel a bit beneath you, um, perhaps financially, because we have um, take care of the pennies, increase in finances. So this is some financial um, situation where you will meet this person. But there's a bond. We have um, connections. Nurture your relationships by showing your friends and loved ones how much you appreciate them. A new love or business partnership as possible. But very, um, they have a youthful appearance, a bit childlike here with children and pets. Very innocent looking. Quite supportive. The, they're giving us strong um, indications about something in regards to money finances. Um, what does this person do professionally? Let's get that. They're, they're starting off right now. They're fairly new. I, I, they may be younger um, is what I'm getting. But also with the two of wands, it's, it's indecision in regards to what they truly want to do. But very creative as a person. If we look at Empress, who's the major arcana, usually is Venus ruled by Venus. So Venus rules creativity so a beautician makeup artist that sort of thing someone who negotiates a model health industry that sort of thing but let's see some group setting though they work in is what they're telling <laughs> yeah they're starting off we have a young man so possibly dark haired who is outgoing friendly and a natural leader he's very expressive loves creating empress and prefers meaningful conversation over chit chat yeah i was getting communication is very important and that's how you're initially bonding this person is still figuring out what they want to do they're young Career, that's interesting. What does this person do for a living professionally? It's not quite giving us one, uh, yeah. We have five of wands and it says conflict. There's some kind of upset or discord around you, an argument or difference of opinions, perhaps. If you are directly involved, choose your words carefully. Hopes and dreams keep going. But regardless of what they're doing, it's not quite telling us anything. I mean, this person's um, just starting off for whatever they're doing, but... They are doing with, they're following their hopes and dreams here. Um, but they are following their heart and it's saying success is just around the corner. So whatever um, this person is doing, they will achieve their goal. They're quite intelligent with that. Yeah, overcoming challenges. Mm -hmm. When you enter this person's life, I 